Hey, what up everyone? I'm Cynical, and this is Gems of War. And today I have spoilers for ya. Spoilers for December 21st, 2020. Happy Holidays, the week of Christmas, the week of whatever you do. It's that week right now. Or it's coming up soon, uh, tomorrow. Uh, also, shout out to Let's Roleplay. Thank you for returning the shout out, man. And, um... Remember to go subscribe to Let's Roleplay. It's like a heavy role-playing RPG channel. Um, he does Pillars of Eternity, Boulder's Gate 2, The Elder Scrolls 3, stuff like that. So if you're interested in those type of games and role-playing of them, go check out his channel, subscribe, tell him Cinny sent you, and uh, let's return the favor. Um, also, link in the description, blue join button, uh, the roster had some casualties so if you want to bolster the roster uh, I know it's Christmas time and everything but I haven't shouted out the members the member uh, link in a while so if you want to join become a center would really appreciate it you get badges for the live streams emojis um, a shout out uh, if you do tier 2 you get all the videos early tier 3 you get to tell me what the topic is for the video for oh, once in uh, once in the month um, yeah, so join button, link in the description. Appreciate it. So spoilers for all platforms coming up right now. Let's go. All right, weekly event spoilers. In the background here is, uh, I think, just my cardio and then green Guild Wars. Go 5-0, and 9,600. Uh, weekly event spoilers, PC, mobile, Xbox, PS4. Before the two-minute mark, Senny, come on. Monday, December 21st, we have campaigns campaign's back. The world event is back. Uh, some of you will be sad. Some of you, I don't know. I'm going to be sad. I, I was enjoying my break from it. Um, so yeah, world event, Monday, December 21st. Zolkari is the kingdom, and the campaign starts over, so we're going to have our third round of campaign. We also are getting a battle crasher, Ragnagord, probably for Christmas. Uh, which is gonna be, in a, it's gonna be really good. Uh, coming up here in a second, I'll tell you why. Uh, faction event Tuesday for City of Thieves. Pet rescue Wednesday for Shelf on an Elf. New Christmas pet. Thursday class event for Orb Weaver. And Friday a Vault event. Awesome. So Christmas Vault event. I'm hoping they like turn it up or whatever, but. Like I said earlier, Battle Crasher, Ragnagord, during a Vault Event, that should be good. The last time that happened was pretty good. I got a bunch of gold. So hopefully it's gold or I don't know. Uh, as long as it's not, I don't know, anything would be fine. It's just extra. Extra. But my idea was maybe they should do like a, either a Battle Crasher or a Gnome every single battle. So pretty much a Battle Crasher every single battle. With like a 10% chance for a gnome or something. Like either turn the gnomes up or do a battle crasher or, and a gnome every battle. Or I don't know. For Christmas. Like on Christmas Day and that's it. Sure. Whatever. But something. Give us a present. You guys. They're trying to get presents from us all the time. With the pay to win stuff. The paid stuff. The offers. So give us a present. Not these corny uh, 12 days of Christmas troops that are not good you know what i mean unless you give us like a mythic on the last day i don't know anyway let's go forward um so vault event coming up this weekend for pc mobile ps4 xbox let's see what kind of new troops we have pc mobile xbox ps4 new troops night spider monday december 21st zolkari does whatever a night spider can Arcane Venom, Base Rarity, Ultra Rare, Troop Type, Beast Rogue, Troop Roll Generator. It's a scary looking spider. Spell is Midnight Poison. Create three blue gems and three purple gems, boosted by rogue allies. Poison a random enemy. So I think it's three times gems per rogue ally. So potentially what? Like 15 blue, 15 purple? Or is it 12? I don't know. It's one of the two. Something like that. Potentially, if you have all rogues. Mana color green, purple. Uh, so it feeds into itself. At least a little bit. 
Mana cost 13. Trait number one, Rogue Bond. Allied Rogues gain two life. Trait number two, Venomous. Poison enemies when doing skull damage. Trait number three, Stealthy. All right, Friday, December 25th, Christmas Day. We are getting a new legendary troop. Might be the uh, thumbnail if you clicked on this video. Nutcracker, 1225. So what is that supposed to be? Something... Uh, I don't know. What's the 1225? Is it 1 usually a L? 5 usually a S? I don't know. Nutcracker 1225. Oh, 1225. I'm an idiot. <laughs> Christmas. Idiot. He's sweet. Arcane Shield. Base rarity legendary. Troop type mech knight. Troop roll generator. So you could probably start him with half mana. If he's a knight, you definitely can. Crack those nuts. Eliminate all armor from an enemy. Explode all gems of one of the enemy's colors. Then explode all stone blocks. I forget where the stone blocks are. For some reason. Is that in Delves? I can't remember. Um, but it explodes all all stone blocks. And explodes all gems of an enemy. One of the enemy's colors. And eliminates all armor from an enemy. Doesn't sound half bad. I'm not saying it's good. But it doesn't sound half bad. Mana color blue brown, mana cost 15. A 15 mana cost legendary. Trait number one, mech shield. Allied mechs gain two armor. Trait number two, impervious. Trait number three, armor supply. Give four armor to all mechs when matching four or more gems. Hmm. Doesn't sound half bad. Nice little Christmas present, I guess, but I'm probably going to have to use keys to get it. Not sure. But yeah, two new troops. One is interesting. They're both kind of interesting. But mostly the Nutcracker uh, 1225. Weapon spoilers. PC Mobile, Xbox, PS4. We have the Nightfall Blade. December 21st. Zolkari. Legendary. Weapon type dagger. Weapon roll warlock. Mana color blue, purple. Mana cost 14. Uh, the Nightfall Blade does magic plus 3 damage to the last enemy. If they are poisoned, inflict four stacks of bleed. It has Mighty, which is gain to attack. Leeching, which is steal two mana from the last enemy. The first enemy, my bad. And Treacherous, deal five damage to the last enemy. And Dark, create a Dark Storm. So a Dark Storm, four stacks of bleed on the last enemy if they're poisoned. Um, and deals five damage to the last enemy. Steals two mana from the first enemy. Doesn't sound great, but not terrible. That's the only new weapon. Um, I don't think... Let me check on this real quick. We're getting a new faction on January 8th, it looks like. I just wanted to check on that. Uh, pet spoilers. Shelf on an Elf. Glacial Peaks is the kingdom. Uh, it's a shelf with uh, elf under it. <laughs> pet color green. Uh, effect is cosmetic. So just a cosmetic pet. But uh, I'll rock it for a day or two for sure. Um, and that's it besides the max kingdom power. If you're interested in that. I don't know how many people are, but if you're super top end of the game, you probably are. On the 21st, Zalkari goes to Kingdom Power 17, and on the 25th, Adana goes to Kingdom Power 17. Probably both from the uh, new troops coming in. Uh, Alright, so that is it for PC, Mobile, PS4, and Xbox One. Um, what is the takeaway? A Vault Event with a Battle Crasher. Sounds pretty good. Also a Legendary on Christmas. That sounds not bad. And that's it. So, Vault Event with a Battle Crasher. And new campaign. New World Event. And new Legendary Troop. Also a new pet. So, new, 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 but spread out one thing. New here, new there. Vault Event, Battle Crasher. Sounds like a pretty good week to me. I'll take it. Sounds nice. Alright, so let's move on to Switch. Nintendo Switch. Spoilers. Uh, let's see what they get on Christmas week. 
Happy Holidays Week, whatever you want to call it. Switch Weekly Event Spoilers for December 21st, 2020. We have, on Monday, you guys are also getting the Ragnagord Battle Crasher. Um, probably all week, probably gold. Um, Tower of Doom, Doom of Light. So, yellow Tower of Doom, you could use, uh, probably Ferocity, or er, Finesse. You could probably use Triple Finesse Nimbus Bow. Or your yellow Guild Wars team, if you don't have that. Uh, what else? I don't know. Those are my two that I could think of off the top of my head without it being the event for me. So, Triple, Fero triple Finesse, I keep saying Ferocity, it's Finesse, 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 Finesse. Triple Finesse. Finesse, finesse, Nimbus bow, finesse. Uh, with storm collar, with a double yellow, purple banner. Tuesday, faction assault on Hall of Guardians. Wednesday, pet rescue, holiday shrub. Class event Thursday, storm collar. There you go. Friday, vault events. We both have vaults of vault events this weekend, so that'll be nice. We can coordinate. You guys can come to the live stream Monday, 6 a.m. EST. Not Monday. What am I saying? Saturday. Tomorrow's Monday. <laughs> Saturday, 6 a.m. EST. This has been a train wreck video. Uh, we both have Vault Event this weekend with a Battle Crasher. That is awesome. Starting on Christmas. All right, let's see what kind of new troops you got here for Switch. I can tell you if they're good or not in the future. We have Lyriath. Uh, not good in the main game, but supposedly okay in Arena. I didn't really find it to be awesome in Arena, but average, above average Arena troop. Uh, Suncrest, Liar Liar, Pants on Fire, Arcane Mountain, Base Rarity, Ultra Rare, Troop Type Strix, Troop Roll Support. It's a bird, a bipedal bird. Mocking Song. Give magic plus one life and two magic to all yellow allies. There's a 35% chance to summon a copy of the first enemy. Mana color yellow brown. Mana cost 12. Trait number one, alert. Immunity to silence. Trait number two, song of light. Summon a light storm at the start of battle. Trait number three, air link. Gain bonus yellow mana from yellow gem matches. Um, And I think that's it. It's your only new troop and it's not good. Weapon spoilers for Nintendo. We have the Doomed Gavel. Not good. Broken Spire. Rarity Doomed. Weapon Type Hammer. Weapon Roll Striker. Get it if you can, but it's not one you're going to ever use. Mana Color Yellow. Mana Cost 18. The spell is Deal Magic plus 5 Heavy Splash Damage to an enemy. Plus 4 per tempering level. Stun all yellow enemies and cleanse all yellow allies. Explode 4 gems. If the enemy has a doom, explode three more. It has lucky, gain two to a random skill. Peaceful, silence the first enemy. Rending, uh, deal three splash damage to a random enemy. Light, create a light storm. Doomed light, drain two mana from yellow enemies. You're also getting the honey dipper on Christmas, Friday, December 25th. From Drifting Sands. Legendary, pole arm. Weapon Roll Striker. Green Brown. Honey Dipper. Mana cost 16. Deal magic plus 2 damage to an enemy and charm them. There are independent 30% chances to gain an extra turn and half my mana back. Uh, it has Vital, which is gain 4 life. Draining, which is drain 3 mana from the first enemy. Reaching, which is deals 5 damage to the second enemy. And Dust, create a dust storm. Not used, but... Um, I think I've seen it used like one time, so better than the Doomed Gavel, but not good. So I wouldn't be uh, getting excited about any of your new stuff so far, but hey, Battle Crasher Vault Event. Uh, you guys have any new classes coming in? Doomsayer comes January 15th. Middle of the road class. Kingdom spoilers for Switch. The Deep Hive comes on Christmas. How did I miss that? So you're getting the Deep Hive on Christmas. So you, we should have more new troops than just that, right? 
Huh. I don't know. I don't get it. It says you're getting D5 on Christmas. We did the troop spoilers, though, and it didn't say Queen B and all that. That's strange. It should have all your new uh, faction troops in the new troop... Uh, the troop spoilers if you're getting the D5. That means Queen Beatrix. Let me check again here. The D5, December 25th, 2020. Friday. So you're going to have a Vault Event and a Faction Assault? I think Terran's World is screwed up, y'all. I think you're... I don't know. They either screwed up and put um, the Vault and you don't actually have the Vault. Or they screwed up and put the that you're getting the D5 and you're not actually getting the D5. So I apologize if... I apologize if Terran's World is wrong. Terran, Terran'sWorld.com is where I get my information. They're usually like 90, 95, 99% accurate, somewhere in there. Um, I've seen that they've missed pets every once in a while, but I've never seen them to make a mistake like this. So I don't know. You guys, I don't know what you have this weekend coming up, uh, Nintendo Switch. It's either Vault Event or the Deep Hive. I'm sorry. But the Queen Bee is, is good. Queen Beatrix is good. So if you have the Deep Hive, you're getting a good troop. She has Royal Honey, which is cleanse on four or five gym matches. That's her last trait. That's a really good trait. Make sure you get her and fully trait her. Um, any pet spoilers for Switch? You're getting the Holiday Shrub on Wednesday, December 23rd from Silver Glade. Pet color green. Effect is cosmetic. It's also saying you're getting the Mini Skeeto on Friday, December 25th. Which I think that is the Deep Hive pet, so... All signs are pointing to Deep Hive. I think the Honey Dipper is also the Deep Hive weapon. So all signs are pointing to the Deep Hive coming in on Friday. But um, it didn't show the new troops and the troop spoilers. Huh. And it also said you had a Vault event. Hmm. Drifting Sands, Mini Skeeto. A red pet color, Kingdom Team bonus for the Deep Hive. I don't know, y'all. I'm sorry. This is confusing. Uh, max Kingdom Power for Switch. But yeah, go to TerranceWorld.com, look at the troop spoilers for Switch, and tell me if you see the Deep Hive troops on there. December 21st, Suncrest Kingdom Power 13. And that is it. But yeah, I would, uh, I could, I guess, go in and search them up and let you know. Uh, let's see if I can figure it out here. But troop spoilers for Switch. It jumps from Lyriath to Gate of Souls on December 28th. That's all they have is Lyriath. There's there's the Queen Bee on January 8th. Queen Bee's coming. It says January 8th here. I don't know. I really don't. Sorry. That's two weeks from this Friday. Hmm. I don't know what to tell y'all. You're either getting the Deep Hive or the Vault this weekend. I apologize. I'll try to update you if I can as the week goes along. Because everything up until Friday should be right. Uh, it's just Friday that I'm having trouble with. It's either you're getting the Deep Hive faction or you're having a Vault event. I don't know. It says both here. Let me go back to the event spoilers and double check myself. Make sure I didn't click on the wrong one. Weekly event spoilers for Switch. Friday, December 25th, it says Vault. And there's nothing else there. It says Thursday, December 24th, Class Event, Stormcaller. Friday, December 25th, Vault. Monday, December 28th, Raid Boss. So there's nothing there. Hmm. I don't know, y'all. We'll see, though. Let me know, I guess. If you know, let me know. We'll put it in the comments. We'll put it in the video. We'll say it tomorrow as well, which will be uh, our... Um, Weekly preview tomorrow? Or not tomorrow. Yeah, it is tomorrow. Monday. Man, I'm all messed up today. But uh, more live streams probably coming this week, too, because uh, it's a holiday week, so I'll have a couple mornings free. Likely, it will be um, Tuesday morning, so look forward to that. Maybe Tuesday morning at 6 a.m. or 7 a.m. So I'll try to um, put a scheduled video out so you know that it's coming 
and I'll say in tomorrow's video if I'm gonna do it or not. Uh, but yeah. Anyway, sorry for the confusion. Like, share, subscribe, consider joining, it helps a lot. Um, would really appreciate it. We need to bolster the sinners, bolster the roster of the choir. We've lost a few, we've had a few casualties. Uh, so hit the join button, please, or the link in the description. You can get cool badges that level up to from from like ultra rare to legendary to mythic um, to the Grim Reaper. Uh, you can get emojis for the live streams. Also, the badges are in your live streams as well. It shows which uh, level badge you are. Um, you can get videos early, every single video early. You can get a shout out, and if you do the top tier, you can suggest a topic of a video, and I'll make a video for you. Uh, each month that you're that tier. So, anyway, like, share, subscribe, consider joining. It helps a lot. Tell your guild about the channel. Comment below. Don't forget the like button. I'll see y'all next time. Peace.